listen, Greyfat. I'll explain it so even you can understand it. Okay, let's do a little review on this head unit I put in here. It's a, uh, it's a 1998 Chevy Corvette. I put in a Soundstream VR535B. Let's see what it looks like when it turns on. Anyways, this is a radio. So let's uh, go through some of these features that it has. We've got the mode button, which is right here. That'll take you through different settings on the radio. SD card, Bluetooth, and it'll audio video in, no signal, that's right here. And we got uh, back to the radio. It'll go to the DVD if there's one in there. This is the power button. Hold it and it'll shut it off. Press it once and it'll come back on. If you lightly press it, it'll mute it. This button is uh, back to select different stations that are in the preset. You can go back. <clears throat> you can go forward. This is a volume knob, of course. It's got a little spider on the knob. It's pretty cool. I like that. It's got a little rubber band on the on the knob too, so you can't slip off of it. We got the select button. <clears throat> get your EQ, all your sound settings. Back. This button here will search your AP PS button. It'll search for all stations or whatever. I don't want to do that, but it'll set stations into your preset buttons. But there's your menu button. Like radio, disc, USB, SD, Bluetooth, settings, audio, video, in. Push it again and go back to radio. If you hold it for a long time, it will tilt the screen out. Got the band and the loud button. Tells you FM2, FM3, AM1, AM2, FM1. If you push and hold it for a long time, it turns the loud on. I don't need that much bass right now. So and we got the open button which takes the cover off. Here, I'll show you. Push the open button right here. It takes the faceplate off. And that light blinks everyone, uh, the whole time that the faceplate is off. Put that back on. Turn it back on. And then we got this open button for the disc. So you can put a disc in. That's the eject button. And we got a USB port here for a USB connection. This is your uh, signal for your remote control. 
this is a mute button here too. So ASPS menu, you can push them all on the screen too if you want. But these buttons all over here do the same thing. So, and like I said, this is your audio video jack. Let's get the remote out. In case we need it. But anyways. Let's uh let's put a disc in. Start playing a movie. Should load here in a minute. Get to the main menu. Monsters Revenge and Monsters Go Home. Let's watch Monsters Go Home. When the movie starts and everything, and if you push the screen, you get all your controls here. Subtitles, audio, menu, next, repeat, or back, and forward, and uh, I'm not sure what these are, but this is fast forward, Let's play, this is fast forward, or rewind, I'm sorry, play, this is stop. Does all kinds of stuff. Disc, DVD, how much time. So. The more you push it, the faster it goes. Itself. Oh, sorry I fell asleep. It's so restful back there. <laughs> Subtitles English, French, or off. Come on, when you're out of the parlor. We don't need subtitles. Best carpool I've ever been in. So, I got my phone out here, so, at least I did. I don't know what I did with my phone now. But here it is. Let's uh, see if we can get this to Bluetooth. Oh, it's only you, Lily. <laughs> I thought it was something scary. Herman, come with me. Okay, Bluetooth power is on, on my phone, so let's uh, hit the menu button and go Bluetooth, and it's pairing. Says it's paired. Connect to sound stream, yes. Phone book.
Well, I guess I'll have to figure that out later. I can't get my phone book to transfer in right now. So, let's do something else. Really is an ad for Sleep America. We'll always beat their best sale price, even if it... Load the disc. DVD again, I guess. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to figure that out. Anyway, it's a pretty cool radio. You can do everything from the touch screen or you can use a remote. Here's the remote. If you got a hot center console, don't put it in there because it will melt it. Learned that from the last radio I had in here. I had a power acoustic in here before and the sound was just so up and down on it, I just hated it. The sound in this seems pretty good. Proceed, Lily. Uh, As usual, that's only on six. Will be the soul of propriety and decorum. Works good. I, Lord Kavanaugh Munster, fourth Earl of Shrub. I'll show you that right SD card goes right here. I already got one in there. It's a 8 gig. It says it can go to 32 gig. But we'll see how big that goes. I like this so far. It's working pretty good. Fits good. I don't know how it looks, but it fits pretty good. Get that disc to load up again and I just call it a day. Hereby convey and bequeath unto my beloved nephew, Herman Munster, my entire estate. Let's go in here. Okay, here you can use uh, EQ, sounds, bass, treble, balance, fader. I've already got it set up to where I want it. Hit the display, you can screen, you can do, well, I'm going to have to use a remote for that, but there goes 16.9, 4.3, or full backlight, the radio area, stereo on, local, I always leave that off, there's the general stuff, you can set the tilt up to whatever you need it. Um, clock display on, clock hour. I got 12 hour. And properties. Oops. Thereby investing him. I guess it times out. But, anyways, you got auto connect, clock settings. You can set your time of day. DVD, you can set everything up here. Password is always 0000. zero, zero, zero. Um, system, you can calibrate your screen for your pen or whatever. I don't have one so I don't have to worry about that. Um, this just gives you what the information is on the disc that's in there. So, let's we'll let that time out and then we'll get back to our DVD. So, the charter, duties, good. and title of Lord Munster. Audio video, there's nothing in that. No signal. Bluetooth, I already tried that. SD card, I showed you that. USB. Right here, I tried to plug in some MP4s on it, but it wouldn't read it. So, anyways. Bar beverage sale. Save 50% on select liquor at That's Safeway. It's for, for life. Offer valid on participating 750 milliliter or larger bottles. Please drink responsibly. This barely misses my shifter knob, so that's don't just trade. That's good that it does. Your trade has never been worth more. Talk to y'all later. I guess we're done. Right. Let's try something here. Let's try to call my wife.
and see what happens. I'm not going to show you the number. Hey, babe. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Cool. Talk some more. So are you talking through your radio, or how does that work? Yeah, I'm just sitting here talking in the driver's seat. Really? I got to come out and see how that works. I don't understand. Okay. Can you hang up? Call ended. Well, can you dial it? Can you, can you call it on your phone? You know, like star two. There's a history button. It's not even showing that, so huh. it's not showing I called your number. Maybe it's maybe it's just a phone I got. It's a cheap phone anyway. But yeah, they, our phones are old, I guess. Maybe it won't work with our phones since they're not smart phones. Yeah. Or they're not super smart. I don't even know what to do with a super smart phone. <laughs> Anyways, Bluetooth works.